If you like bridges and tunnels and listening to a dude talk to possibly no one other than himself, or maybe just you, you've come to the right nook here on YouTube. Recently, I took a trip up the East Coast to Salisbury, Maryland, and Salisbury is in this unique part of the state. It's almost as far east as you can go, and it's in part of the state that is cut off by water on all sides, except coming from the north. It's cut off by the Chesapeake Bay on the west coast and the Atlantic Ocean on the east coast. Now, coming in from the south as I did, you get the opportunity to cross the Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel System, and it's amazing. It's a remarkable man-made wonder, and it's truly a must-drive over and through experience if you're ever in the area. Now, at the end of the bridge, we'll hop over to a quick tip and trick eBay session for those who want to stick around and hopefully find some value in how I managed to turn a side hustle into a fun and lucrative and life-changing day job that allows me to get out on the road and experience this fantastic and beautiful country. So sit back or stand up, whatever you want to do, and enjoy. I'll interrupt your calming music and peaceful state with a few fun facts about the bridge as we drive over it together. common questions I get is, Kyle, what's wrong with you? As a reseller, one of the most common questions I get is, what do I sell? Quick answer is, I sell anything that I can make money on. Longer answer would be, I sell anything that I can make money on that I also enjoy selling. Uh, I sell toys, clothes, tools, games, both video games and board games, small electronics, sports equipment. The makeup is always really good. I don't know much about antiques. I don't care about antiques. I don't, I don't care to learn about antiques. Cars, houses, like, but I'm not interested in that. What I'm interested in is small items that are easy to manage and ship and store like on shelves in these racks behind me. Small, simple, stuff anybody can learn this stuff quick tip for some of the more common things that are out in the wild and not many people know that there's a lot of value in these things and Legos are everywhere you can't go anywhere without stepping on these things and there's a lot of people that want to sell their Legos kids are growing up they're old Legos anymore and you don't have to sell just new Legos a lot of this these loose Legos a lot of people don't think has a lot of value but you can sell this stuff by the pound by five pounds by ten pound boxes a lot of people and families will sell these buckets of all loose pieces and you can also find boxes obviously sealed boxes do do pretty well sometimes they'll sell for 10 bucks sometimes 30 sometimes 50 or 100 maybe even a thousand bucks yeah. i'm going to show you on the screen right now i sold one of these suckers for 1200 bucks it's rare but it happens and i found that lego for a dollar at a thrift store so mini figurines you can find a lot of these when you buy big buckets like this if you're a lego connoisseur 
and you know these Legos and which sets they go to or all the characters and their names. Some of them can be worth 20 bucks, 30 bucks, 50 bucks. I like to lot up batches of 25 or 50 or 100 and I'll throw it on an eBay auction, make a couple hundred bucks just selling these little dudes. Ink cartridges, even if they are expired, they still have value. If it's just a year or two or three out uh, past the expiration date, you can still sell them on eBay. You can still get 50 to 60% of new value even for old, retired, and expired. A lot of people even throw these out or get rid of them at lawn sales or get them for 50 cents or a dollar. Inks will still go for even just like this. Even if this were expired, you could get 15 bucks out of it. You can get 25, 50, even $75 for some of these things and you only have to pay a dollar or two. They're just two super simple, small things that you can find out in the wilds of garage sales and thrift stores that usually sell really well and you can usually buy for really cheap. Send me questions, let me know what you wanna know and I will see you next time.